now. That's where Eastern Virginia Medical School is investigating its yearbook activities after that controversial picture on Governor Northam's page was found. Ten on your side discovered yesterday that's not the only questionable picture in one of the school's yearbooks. Our Andy Fox is live finding out where people stand on the racist picture and whether Ralph Northam should resign. Andy? Every politician, especially for those up for re-election this year, are running as hard and fast from Ralph Northam as they possibly can. But today we wanted to find out what the people think. Do the people think he should resign? No comment. We worked the street to find out what people think about this racist picture appearing on Governor Ralph Northam's 1984 EVMS yearbook page. What do people think? Sure. Should he resign? Many didn't want to answer. We were told those associated with EVMS and the surrounding medical facilities told not to comment on the racist picture. Are you going to talk to the people in the indoors? No, I care about what you think, sir. You guys have a good day, okay? Okay, thank you. We found an African American woman who did not want to appear on camera, and we asked her, should Governor Northam resign? Based on what you know, do you think he should resign? I don't think he should resign, actually. I think he should continue to, if, you know, if he has his values, and I think he should continue to um, do what's best for him. Not for Virginia? And for Virginia. We met Eileen Conyers. She finds the governor hurtful with a shocking picture, surprising. But should Governor Northam resign? I don't think he should resign. Okay, why is that? I don't, I don't know, Andy. I don't think he should resign. That it does not rise to the level of his having to resign. Right. What do you think about the governor in the picture? I can't speak on that. How come? I can't. This is an opportunity for him to come out and, and share and speak on um, this topic and educate our communities. Like many elected officials who have run hard and fast from Governor Northam, Von Anthony doesn't trust Governor Northam's flip flopping on who is in this picture. She can't get past that. Did that not play well with you? Um, no, it didn't play well with me. <laughs> I really, I mean, I'm not going to condemn the man. It wasn't nice then, and it isn't nice now. Do you think he should resign? I do. Yep, so there you have wide sample there. Uh, both sides, yes, no. Once again, Ralph Northam remains holed up in the governor's mansion surrounded by few friends, people still calling for his resignation. As I've said before, he's like a small island in a raging sea, and everyone wants him to resign. As of tonight, he refuses to do so and continues to fight on. In Norfolk, Andy Fox, 10 on your side.